So today I want to continue my series on uh, tying the mole leech or mother of all leech. Uh, I tied some pretty long ones and now actually I'm trying to tie a few um, short ones. So I've, I've tied up a couple of different various lengths, uh, which on the article I talked through that. I've also picked up a few new tips that uh, I'm doing, one of which is to uh, cut off the tip of this hook so it's not sharp. And I also um, put some tape or some kind of... Um, something over the, the rear trailing hook, which is really the sharp one. And actually what I figured out is I knew there was going to be a secret way to use a Norvice to, to do this, and, and I think I figured it out. So pretty pretty simple here. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to just put my thread on backwards here and just kind of pull that out of the way. I can leave it back here on the materials holder, um, etc. And I'm actually going to adjust this just a tiny little bit here. So that I get the, uh, see if I can get the post in here. So from this point, basically what I'm going to do is I've made a, a tricky little system here, which is just a piece of um, backing that I'm going to loop over the end of the hook. And then I've got my weight, which is just an algae bottle that I filled with water and looped that over the top. I'm going to then pull that tight get the hook so it's facing away from me and all I do is simply hang that over the post. So now I've got a nice um, tight uh, platform to work from and I don't need two vices. I knew it was going to be possible, I just had to think about it for a while. So um, I've got my, my rabbit strip where I've glued on my tail section. So I've just got my tail section, I've prepped a little tiny bit there um, for that. So I'm going to lift my, uh, my weight off here and then I'm simply going to slide my little tiny bit of uh, leather that I've cleaned the fur off of up right up next to that hook, go back on with my weight. And then what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to come in here with my super glue. So just some Zappa Gap. And I, I like to put it onto the bodkin here. And I'm just going to touch it right in there and just secure down that leather liquid thread as they call it. I'm going to fold it over and now that's completely bonded onto there. So I don't have to use any thread on that rear section. So from here um, I get to do the fun step of putting tear mender basically on the back of of the rabbit here as I move along, which is kind of messy stuff, but it's okay. Some of it will get on the fur, it'll still come out. So I'm going to put a little bit on there, and then basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap pulling the, the fibers backwards, and I'm just going to slowly wrap my way forward, transition up onto the front of the hook. But uh, And then when you're done, one of the, the other tricks I like to do is to come in here um, with the bodkin and pick out anything that might have been trapped down and basically you're going to end up you're going to break off that hook um, and then you're going to end up with a nice uh, short mole leech which might be more appropriate for summer hope that helps